Okay, today we're going to put on a new rear wing. This is a Subaru part, and they actually have them pre-painted. And uh, this is one of the last ones that they had, but that was the way that they did it. So it's all pre-painted, and they didn't really want to sell us one that was not painted. So it's kind of an interesting way of doing it, but kind of cool that it's already matching. What's super nice about this one is it already has the third brake light installed with all the wiring. So we're just going to basically unplug it. And if this helps, you can see where it mounts on this side and this side. And there's also some kind of push pins as well that keep it in place. Okay, so coming up to the top here, you'll see these little covers. You want to come in with a flathead screwdriver very carefully and just pry these upward. And then this little cover just pulls up and out. Okay, now we'll just repeat on this side and pull this one off. And then that's a 10 millimeter screw. And so you can either use a Phillips screwdriver or 10 millimeter, and that's what we'll use to remove those. Okay, so from the inside now, we're just gonna pull down on this middle panel. So you're just removing it here. So just watch this clip to come out of there. And then we're just pulling straight down on these clips in order to separate this piece here. Okay, so now we're gonna disconnect the wiring that goes from the third brake light to the body harness of the car. And it helps to have a pick or something of this nature and to basically reach in here and pry it outward. There's a little ridge that you can see there. See how it goes up right there. And so you're just trying to get it out from underneath there. So now this is disconnected. Now we're gonna use another 10 millimeter, but it has to be a deep socket to fit over that stud. We're gonna go ahead and remove both that nut and the one that's back in here. Now you'll wanna take a pair of pliers and come in here and everywhere you find one of these, what you're wanting to do is pinch them so that you can uh, pinch them and slightly push upward so that these will slide back out. These are meant to expand as they pop into place, so you got to just pinch them and then push up on the wing in order to get them to come out. Okay, so then just grab hold and pull upward and eventually they will all come out. So just pull it up out. Now we're going to just lift this off of the back. So if you want, you can even close the tailgate for this part. But as you're lifting up, you want to put a screwdriver under that grommet and then just pry it out. Okay, so we just pulled that wire out and now our wing is free. Now we'll just go ahead and clean this area real good and then install the new one. Okay, that's all clean now, so we'll just put the new one on. Just slide the electrical cable back through that hole and line it right up. Now just reinstall the 10 millimeter screws in the top. Replace the cover just by sliding it in that way first, and then it'll pinch down. I'm really surprised the new wing didn't come with new ones. Okay, we put our 10 millimeter nuts back in on each side here where we removed them, and you can use those to help draw the wing down um, if these clips up here aren't quite all the way in, push them in by hand, try to get them to snap in. And then uh, just be very careful on this part to go back and forth. Tighten it down a little over here, a little over here, back and forth, and do not over tighten it. You don't want anything to crack. So just do it very lightly, hand tight. And then next we're just gonna plug in our uh, plug back right here. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and uh, install this cover. It just pushes right back straight into place. And just watch all these that are kind of angled on each of these. So just make sure that they go in right. Okay, so that helped to line up the tabs on each side first, and then just go through like this and then it'll pop into place on each of them. Now just test to make sure that third brake light works. So that's how to install the rear wing. If you have any questions, please put it in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks guys.